Tonight marks three years since a woman fell five stories from a building in downtown Johnson City, setting off a series of events that led to the arrest of a former Tri-Cities businessman. Good evening, I'm Sarah Diamond. Michaela Evans survived that fall from the apartment of Sean Williams. Following her fall, Williams was indicted with being a felon in possession of ammunition. That charge came as a result of police investigating the circumstances surrounding that incident. Williams has since been charged with several additional crimes, including child pornography production, child rape and sexual exploitation of a minor. Williams is being called a serial rapist in two separate federal lawsuits, claiming that Johnson City Police mishandled some of the rape incidents that were reported to them by several women. Williams has not been charged in any of those alleged crimes. But in the case of Michaela Evans, she's still seeking answers. News Channel 11's Jayana Scurry spoke with her tonight. Jayana. Sarah, after three years, Michaela Evans has made amazing strides in her recovery, but still struggles daily. She says she would still like to see justice done for what happened to her. Michaela Evans says on this third year anniversary of her falling out of Sean Williams' fifth floor story window, that the day hasn't been as bad as she thought it would feel. Had uh, either one or two friends with me most of the day, and now my son's home from school, so if nothing else, I'll have him for the rest of the night. Um, but if I get alone, then yeah, I have start struggling and crying. Evans says she still wants justice and doesn't believe her fall was an accident. I think I've had a pretty good day, but I want I guess people to pay for what happened to me and for not doing what they should have when it did happen to me. Evan still doesn't remember the last minutes leading up to her fall. I don't remember going down the street, going up in the apartment, going in there, walking around. If I, they, one says they used the restroom, one says they don't remember. So even if I did, I don't remember that. I don't remember falling out the window. I just remember waking up in the hospital starting to panic. Evans has had an extensive recovery these past three years. I've had to have extensive physical therapy and OT therapy. Um, I was flat on my back for five months, so I had to learn how to walk again. She says insurance pays for most, but she still struggles. Sean Williams was recently indicted on charges of child rape, child porn production, and sexual exploitation of a minor. To be honest with you, it makes me sick and it disgusts me. Evans says she wouldn't have been around Williams that night if she would have known about his alleged actions before, and she feels that her fall wasn't properly investigated. My case was not investigated like it should have been. There was lots of things left out. There was lots of things not done that should have been done. We did reach out to the Washington County, Tennessee District Attorney asking if there was a case being built surrounding Evans' fall. We have not yet received a response. Sarah. Jana, thanks.